leverage etf now obviously an etf is a fund that tracks an index a leverage etf is a leveraged fund which means it will borrow money for the purpose of investing more in the index or it will invest in say options or futures in order to amplify the consequences so the good part about leveraged etf is that if we have a leveraged etf based on nifty and nifty goes up by 5% then this leveraged etf promises to pay you two times three times that so you will earn 10% or 15% that's the potential you know leverage is a double edged sword for example if nifty goes down 5% then you will lose 10% 15% plus there are transaction fees management fees okay because a fund which is buying options and options you know are depreciating asset is losing the premium na so leveraged etf is a normal etf but it's too risky because the transaction management fees are very high and the leverage is very high and leverage is a double edged sword so remember this for leveraged etf if we talk about inverse etf so inverse etf is like leverage etf only but it's actually buying put options on the index so if it's buying put options on the index that means it will give you returns when the index falls so it's inverse etf so leverage etf and inverse etf are normally coming in the same category because they are using derivative instruments and borrowing for the purpose of amplifying the consequences now if you are a bullish person optimistic person you will think the consequences are going to be plus so therefore three times four times you will get but if you are a pessimistic person the consequences could be inverse and therefore you will lose three times four times so these instruments should be gone into only when you really feel that you have the risk appetite in fact if you think about who goes for these instruments let's understand that agar mere ko koi koi stock ya index trade karna hai to mere ko broker ke through wo buy karna padta na margin pe because mere paas zyada paisa nahi hai so i want to trade it via broker theek hai or i have to buy options which are once again costly instead i can go for leveraged etf which provide the same thing but also offer economies of scale to so, that can be the reason why people go for it one very important point is that agar aapne leverage dtf buy kiya on nifty nifty pe hai wo to kya long term mein se 6 saal 6 mahina 1 saal mein kya nifty ka return aur leverage dtf ka return comparable hoga ekdam bhi nahi ekdam comparable nahi hoga because ye sab short term mein operate karta hai theek hai leverage dtf is only a suitable instrument for the short term say a matter of few days ya maximum a fortnight or a month you can't think about स्ट्रेचिंग इट मैंने फोर्थ नाइट भी ज्यादा बोल दिया ठीक है डेज आर टू मच सो अकॉर्डिंगली इसका वन ड्रॉबैक क्या है यू विल बाय लेवरेज डी टी एफ और निफ्टी थिंकिंग डेट ओह निफ्टी का रिटर्न रेप्लीकेट करेगा एंड यू विल फाइंड एक साल बाद निफ्टी बढ़ गया साठ परसेंट लेवरेज डी टी एफ का लॉस हो रहा है तो डू नॉट केवल शॉर्ट टर्म के लिए लॉन्ग टर्म के लिए नहीं है जो बीमोट के सीनेरियो था जहाँ पे ई टी एन के बारे में वो लोग नेगेटिव बोला था कि ई टी एन में सेटलमेंट रिस्क का आई सेट डेट ई टी एन में सेटलमेंट रिस्क हो ही नहीं सकता है बिकॉज ई टी एन कोई ओवर द काउंटर डेरिवेटिव थोड़ी एंटर कर रहा है ठीक है वहीं पे इफ यू रीड प्रॉपरली इन द बीमोट सीनेरियो दे हैव स्पोकन अबाउट द फैक्ट डैट ये जो लेवरेज और इनवर्स ई टी एफ है इनमें जो रिटर्न है लॉन्ग टर्म में दे आर नॉट एज पर द एक्सपेक्टेशन ऑफ द अंडरलाइंग इंडेक्स येस दे आर नॉट बिकॉज दे आर मेट फॉर द शॉर्ट टर्म ठीक है तो स्टडी को फिर से रेफर कीजिएगा बेमेंट केस सीनेरियो